Hey guys, so it's been a little while since I filmed a what I wore in a week video and I thought as daylight savings is going to be ending very soon that I take the opportunity while we've still got a bit of sunlight to film um, what I'm wearing for the week ahead. Today is obviously Monday, it's about 29 degrees today so it is going to be fairly warm so I'm not taking a jacket. It doesn't really feel like autumn weather still. Yesterday was 38 degrees, it was swelteringly hot, um, didn't really want to spend too much time outside uh, but today I've gone for a really kind of monochromatic simple look. My earrings are from Reliquia and you might have seen these. I've been wearing them a lot in my videos. I'm obsessed. They're kind of this really gorgeous little spiral detail and they've got a lever kind of clip closure at the back. I really like them. They're not too weighty and I just feel as though they kind of elevate all of my outfits. I The only other accessory that I'm wearing is my watch from Linnea. You guys know I love this and I just think it goes really well with the outfit that I've got on today. All right, so I'll step back so you can kind of see the outfit in full. I am going to wear my Max Mara heels, which are at the office, but this top that I'm wearing today is from Sportscraft, and it has this really cool abstract black and white print on it, which I really like, and it's just nice and oversized and slouchy, and it's sort of an update. I, I feel like it's a dressed up tee, which I sort of think everyone should have in their wardrobe. I'm wearing it in a size eight and it's very oversized. So if you are looking at getting something like this, maybe size down. The skirt that I'm wearing is from Country Road and you will have seen this in my professional workwear lookbook. It has this button down detail at the front and then these little pockets here, which are pretty handy. Again, like this one's really big. I got it in the size four uh, it really fits, I think, more like a size 8. It's a little bit big for me, but um, I like where it sits. It's not too kind of short. Right now on my feet, I'm wearing my Everlane Day heels, but as mentioned, I am going to uh, walk to work in my Converse, so I'm going to wear my Max Mara heels, and I've got a new bag. So the bag that I'm wearing with this outfit is my Everlane Market Tote, I believe this one's called. I really like this. It's a lot bigger than my linear tote bag. It doesn't have a closure, which is probably the only thing that I feel like is missing from it, but it's a really good size. Um, and it's been holding up really well. I haven't had any color transfer or anything since I've been using it. So yeah, that is my outfit for Monday. So today is Tuesday and just another day in the office as usual. It's cooled down a little bit thankfully. It's about 27 degrees today. It looks like it's going to rain later. So I imagine the temperature is going to drop a bit more and the pressure will drop which will be really nice because we've had such hot weather lately. I've gone for something really kind of easy and floaty today. Uh, I'm wearing, um, I'm not wearing any earrings but I am wearing a necklace you guys probably will never have seen before on me. Um, it's this gold ank. Um, and I've had this since I was a kid. Um, my dad gave this to me and he has the matching ring. Uh, I'm wearing my Daniel Wellington watch. I will say I don't love the strap on this because it's so thick. Uh, it, it doesn't really mold to the shape of your wrist very well. Uh, then let me show you guys my outfit. Okay, so as mentioned, going for something very, very easy. I'm wearing this check blazer from Storm. Um, then underneath I'm wearing my um, black silk cami from Grana and I've got it tucked into my black silk culottes from Grana. On my feet I'm currently wearing my Charlotte Olympia. These are just a pair of little pointed toe ballet flats with a gold heel. I'm not sure whether I'm going to wear these or if I'm just going to walk to work in my uh, Roche runs and then wear my Max Mara heels because I tend to wear those a lot. I will insert a little photo here maybe of what they look like. Then for my bag, I'm using this Everlane tote bag. I really want to do kind of a review on this versus the Linear tote bag. And I was thinking of possibly also getting one from Kuyana too to do a comparison. Let me know if that's something you guys would be interested in seeing. But I'm loving this and I haven't really got it full to capacity today. But kind of got all of my stuff in there. Um, and it also fits my laptop as well. I've also actually got some gym gear as well, which I'm going to be taking with me to work because uh, as part of a health and wellbeing program at work, they're doing Pilates classes every single Tuesday. So I'm pretty excited as I missed out last week just because I was so slammed with work. But um, yeah, I'm kind of looking forward to getting back into a bit of exercise. So that's it for me today. I will see you guys tomorrow.
Hey guys, so it is Wednesday today. It's actually really miserable outside. It's about 21 degrees, so quite cold. I'm gonna have to take my umbrella to work today. Um, I'm actually going to the Dua Lipa concert after work with Google, so um, I kind of dress in something that I think will be relatively comfortable. It's at Luna Park in Big Top, so quite excited about that. Uh, let me just get in front of the mirror. Um, so for my earrings, I'm wearing the Majuri Editor Hoops. I think you guys probably know I really like these earrings. I don't have any other accessories on just because it's rainy and I'm always a bit funny about wearing too many accessories when going to concerts. Then for my outfit I'm wearing this kind of mauve colored turtleneck uh, made out of modal from Brana which I really like. Then I've got my Celine Trotter bag. I just thought this was a good size to take to a concert and it's relatively durable so I know it's not going to get damaged. And then my skirt is this gorgeous top shop kind of hanky hem skirt I really love this I adore it, actually it's just very sweet and I think very flattering and then on my feet I am wearing my Eveline day heels these things are just indestructible uh, kind of the perfect shoe for for walking around that kind of thing yeah, this is the full outfit today. So it's Thursday now. Dua Lipa last night was so amazing. I had the most incredible time. I will insert maybe some footage and some photos from the event, but like she just killed it. It was such a fun night and really had a good time. So it's just another day in the office. I don't really think I've got any plans for after work tonight. So it'll be a nice relaxed day and kind of a nice way to slide on through towards the weekend. We're almost there. Um, let me show you my outfit. Oh, okay, accessories, sorry. I'm wearing my Reliquia uh, spiral kind of earrings again. I love these, they're sort of like a coiled earring. There you go, you might be able to see them a bit better. Then I am wearing a bracelet from Pandora. Um, that's what it looks like. It's kind of, it's from their new Shine collection. It's sort of a limited edition honeycomb bracelet, which I think is really gorgeous. Then for the rest of my outfit, I've gone for something really kind of basic today. And sorry about the weird lighting. Like it's quite dark outside. So for my top, I'm wearing this ruffle sleeved top from Vera Moda, which featured in my professional workwear lookbook video. So if you haven't watched that, please do. I am so happy with how it turned out. And I feel like there's 10 really lovely workwear looks in there. Um, my belt is from Isabel Morant. And I actually bought this um, last last year during the sales I did a whole video like come online shopping with me so again I will link that one up here as well so you guys can go check it out if you like my jeans are from redone and I got these during Shopbop's recent sale I really like them they're kind of a high waist they've got a button fly and then they're cropped at the ankle my shoes are from Country Road and they're very much kind of in the same vein of those shoes from the row without the heel. I really like them. I also got them in the burgundy because I couldn't help myself. I'm loving burgundy at the moment. My trench coat, because it is raining. Oh. My trench coat is from Everlane. This one I've had for probably a couple of years now and I'm just wearing it over my shoulders at the moment. Or maybe I should show you what it looks like on. Hold on. Okay, this is what it looks like on and then my bag... And back to the Eveline tote bag. So this is kind of my full outfit today. Hey guys, so today is Friday. Just gonna have another day in the office. I'm about to head to work now with Luke. Um, and yeah, I guess I thought I'd show you my outfit. I'm not really wearing any accessories today just because I've got this really huge bulky knit sweater on and I don't want my earrings to catch if I decide to take this off because I've got a t-shirt on underneath. So let's show you my outfit. Okay, so on my top, I'm wearing this huge oversized cable knit sweater from Eveline. I've been wanting this for ages. It's kind of like a wool cashmere mix. Here's kind of a close-up of the detail. It's really nice, like very heavy weight. And I feel like this is going to be a great kind of staple as we get further into autumn and progress through to winter. Then on my bottom half, I'm wearing a denim skirt. This is just my... ASOS denim skirt. You guys will have seen this about a million times already, I'm sure. And actually, this kind of look is in my denim lookbook, which would have gone live on Monday. So if you haven't watched it, I'm going to link it up here for you guys to check out. Then on my feet, 
I'm wearing my Sam Edelman loafers. These are such a great dupe for the Gucci loafers. Honestly, I they're so comfortable too. I really like the way that they look. Uh, and I just think that they are very similar. So good option if you don't want to spend a lot of money. And then my bag is my Eveline tote bag again. Really been enjoying this and I love the color palette. There you go. Hey guys, so it is Saturday today. Today is going to be a really super chill day at home. We don't really have anything on the agenda, which is really nice. I had a really late sleep in this morning. I slept in until about quarter to 11, which Honestly, I don't normally sleep in at all. I'm usually awake by about 7.30, so that was a bit different, uh, but I'm just in something really comfortable today. Very sort of relaxed. Like I said, I'm just gonna be doing housework and errands around the home. Okay, so today I'm wearing this open knit sweater from Marge. You probably will have seen this from one of my previous What I Wore in a Week videos. I really like it though, just very kind of relaxed, very easy to wear. Then I've got it worn belted with this belt from Sportscraft. I really like the color of this. It's just a really nice, rich brown shade. My jeans are from Country Road and these are very similar to those ASOS stepped hem Farley mom jeans that I've got, uh, but they're a little bit more expensive. I just like the wash on them and they're very comfortable. And then on my feet, I'm wearing my Country Road kind of bow slide shoes again. I adore these. They're so comfortable to wear because they are a suede. So that is my full outfit today. So that's everything that I'm wearing today. I actually thought I'd share with you guys something that I got on the post because um, it's pretty exciting delivery. Uh, so I, you probably will have seen now um, that Eveline have launched an underwear collection and they sent me a few pieces to kind of try out and everything's really lovely. Like the cotton is super soft, it's very stretchy. Um, the white is not opaque, just in case you're wondering, um, and I'm probably not going to show you guys what this looks like, so what this looks like on, but I will insert a little picture here of what the bodysuit looks like. So it's the box, um, and inside I've received the tank bodysuit, the bikini, and also the hipster brief. There's also a really sweet little garment bag in here, which will come in handy. So I don't know, one really big one, which is good. And I think in here, this just smells like lavender, which makes the entire box smell very beautiful. Yes, yeah, so that's what they very kindly sent over to me. So thank you so much, guys. Um, I did post about this on my Instagram stories in case you missed it. So I just thought I'd bring you guys into my study because um, Luke's watching something down in the garage and I don't know how much you guys can hear it, but I also thought I'd mention that I have finally gotten around to getting Authority, which is the second book in the Southern Reach trilogy, and I'm really enjoying it. How far am I through? About a third of the way through so far. Really, really loving this book. So it's a bit different to the first one, but I can't kind of wait to see where the story goes. So yeah, do let me know in the description box below if you have been reading these books and what you think of them as well. So it is Sunday today, just another kind of chill day at home. I spent the morning filming another workwear lookbook. You guys really seem to enjoy the kind of more corporate workwear lookbook that I put up the other week. But where I'm going with this is I got a comment asking if I could share some outfits for teachers. Now, the last time I was in school was, well, you know, at high school was 13 years ago. So I can't really remember what my teachers wore, but I thought it might be really good to do more of a, a bit more of a relaxed, still professional outfits, ones that you can wear if you work in a more creative industry. So I filmed that this morning. Now I am just kind of, um, I've been working on some flat lays. This is kind of the remnants of it at the moment. I'm also going to be doing some reviews on these palettes here from Rimmel for Kate Moss. I really like them. I've been using this every day for the past two weeks and I've also got this highlight one as well. So I'm doing a review on those on my blog. I'm also going to do a review on this Narcissus palette because I really like it. Oh, I've been using it a lot and I kind of just wanted to share my thoughts. That's what the inside looks like. If you haven't seen this one before, this is the Wanted palette. So it's pretty hot. I'm actually just wearing a kind of t-shirt denim <laughs> skirt combo. Nothing exciting, I'm afraid, but I will show you what I am wearing. Segway. Winston, what are you doing? Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. 
Sorry about that, I seem to be very easily sidetracked today. So I've gone for a very minimal kind of color palette. I am wearing this black and white striped tee from Brandy Melville that I've had for quite a while now. I really love how comfortable this is. It's just a cotton. I have seen similar ones, so I will link them down below because this is old now. Um, I am wearing this very old Country Road Belle. I think I've had this since I was 18, so that kind of shows you its age. My skirt is my J. Crew white denim skirt. I adore this. I wear it a lot. And um, one of you guys actually messaged me to tell me that it had come back in stock. So I will link it down below because they seem to have redone it for spring summer, which is awesome. Then on my feet, I'm wearing these Eveline Loafer Mules. I really like these. They're so comfortable and I love the tassel detail on them. I just think it's very chic. And they look great for work too. So there you go, that's the full outfit today. So there you have it, seven more days of outfits. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. Um, everything that I wore will be linked in the description box below in case you wanna go and check anything out. And I would love to know which outfit was your favorite. I'll see you guys next time with a brand new video. See you soon, bye.